Hi, this is Christian Marquardt from Science in Motion. We just returned from Orlando, where we presented our next innovation, the SEM Ball Tracker. This is a camera-based system to measure the track of the ball. And there was a great interest in the system. Um, and I will show you some of the features here. So if I open up this data set, which is a USPGA Tour player, I open up the ball tracking report and now you see all the parts in a top view. Let us just focus on one single part. Maybe we select the first part, which is now the blue line down here. So it goes a little bit from left to right. All the balls were hold, as you can see. So this first part started 0.2 degrees to the right and there was a launch speed of 2.2 meters per second. So there are more data on um, the skid and roll phase of the ball, which can be explained if you look at the ball speed curve. So the gray area is the skid of the ball. And for the skid phase, we calculate skid distance, skid time, and the speed drop to launch speed. And then once the ball starts rolling, it gets pure roll. We can calculate the roll speed the roll ratio, ball distance, and we can also calculate the effective stim. So this data can be used for different purposes like putter fitting or optimizing the ball roll for a specific type of player. At the same time, all this data can certainly be connected to um, the other data from Sam Lab. So I switch to the 3D view. This is now um, a 3D view from down the line. You can see all the putter data and you can see the ball rolling on its true path to the hole and into the hole. You can look at it certainly from any angle um, and you can switch on the ball trace history where you can see all the parts and the paths in the top view. So I think this is a fantastic tool for teaching coaching and we will um, show some more videos on this soon. Thanks for watching this video. If you want to get more information, you might also visit our webpage, Science in Motion, www.scienceinmotion.com. Thanks for watching this video.